After replacing for that, you have to shoot on the supply power for the radar. And you can shoot on the radar again. You switch on the power for the radar. And then you have to keep the radar on standby mode for at least 30 minutes for the new magnetron. Okay? So after waiting for five, uh, 30, 30 minutes, you can, uh, you know, change for just mid time. So I will show you how to do that later. So you just uh, keep standby mode like that for at least 30 minutes before you transmit again, okay? I will be back later. So after waiting for 30 minutes, you can change the radar to transmit mode, okay? So let me show you. You press on the standby and transmit button. So before reset the transmit time for radar, you have to do some more step to make sure that you were properly changed for the magnetron. Okay? So you press on the menu, then you select echo. Then you select on tuning, initialize. And then you just wait for initialization. Just wait for the moment. You can see this one's still running. You see a target still initialized. Okay, after finishing that, you click on the menu again, then you select echo. Now you have to do performance monitor test. Click on. You can see that when you press on the performance monitor, it will appear the arts, the five arts on the screen. One, two, three, four, five, because I was setting here five arts. Now you just use the, you know, the range to measure the arts. Just follow the manual instruction, okay? So to finish that, you press on the 
up. So now I will proceed to reset transmit time for this radar. So to reset that, you have to open the initial menu. You press and hold on the 8L off and press menu five times. Press and hold and press menu five times. One, two, three, four, five. You can see. So when this screen appears, you click on the installation. Then so you click on the transmit time. Now you have to change the transmit time to zero. Zero, 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 zero. So you can see our transmit time now is zero. So just like that. So now you can put that on the transmit mode to adjust the, the gain. Then you can detect the target around. You can see it's good, right? Okay, so after finishing for that, you have to record into radar record book and also you remark for the time to change the magnet trend. Okay, okay, everyone, that's all for me. Thank you very much for the watching. So, I hope this video is helpful for you. If you want to see more video, please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Thank you, and I'll see you in next video. Bye-bye.